Hello and welcome back to CPHI Frankfurt. We're here with Emanuele from Indina. Emanuele, can you introduce yourself and your role at Indina, please? Sure. My name is Emanuele Agnese. I work at Indina in the business development team as business development manager. I joined the company in 2020 and that's it. <laughs> so let's talk a little bit about business continuity. Can you expand on what Indina is doing about business continuity? Sure. Business continuity is about building a resilient framework that enables businesses to respond effectively at time of crisis and uncertainty as those the world has been exposed in the last two and a half years. It's difficult to predict what future has in store, but safeguarding business partner interests has always been a priority for Indina see, over the last 100 years. And at Indina, we have a solid business continuity plan and uh, disaster recovery strategies that help our organization to stay on track, even in challenging times. The operational risk identification and business impact analysis involve the 22 key functions across the organization, and the dedicated operational structure has been appointed to face potential disruption. To give you a practical example, and uh, thanks to the work done so far, in case of uh, a gas supply interruption, at Indina we already have in place uh, an emergency plan and countermeasures that allowed the restoring of 80% of steam generation capacity within 72 hours, guaranteeing a manufacturing continuity. Moreover, to mitigate the external factor, such as supply chain challenges, Indina is increasing inventories of key starting material in high inflation and challenging times to provide high-level services and stability to our partners. That's extremely interesting. Thank you very much. And can you tell us what CDMO services you provide at Indina? Indina is a well-known player in the space of naturally derived molecule and with a solid background and know-how developed along its 100-year history. At the same time, the company increasingly expanded its technological offer beyond that, now handling also fermentation and fully synthetic compounds and molecules. So basically, while, while uh, the area of natural derived molecule is still one of our key expertise, uh, a logic decision of Indina was to capitalize on uh, technologies rather than the origin of the molecules. And this is the reason why now uh, we develop a knowledge, a strong knowledge and uh, manufacturing capacity to manufacture highly potent APIs with an OEL down to 20 nanogram per cubic meter. This is just uh, an, an example. And uh, also, coming from natural derivative industry, we have uh, a high-skill analytical team and also analytical developments are our core expertise. So just to complete uh, the technological offer at Indina, we offer uh, also, of course, uh, the manufacturing of natural APIs and uh, semi-synthetic APIs, but also full, fully synthetic APIs with a focus on high potent, highly potent compounds and fermentation molecule, as well also fermentation of high potent compounds, and uh, as well as spray and drying activities from organic solvent, and uh, that's it. Emanuele, thank you so much for talking to us today and informing us on what's happening with Indina. We'll see you next year at CPHI in Barcelona. Thank you so much. Thank you.